A journey for justice has turned into a very unique love story. One of the WNBA's brightest stars, Maya Moore, recently married the man she helped free from prison, Jonathan Irons. And they're sharing how it all came to be in a new memoir entitled Love and Justice, a story of triumph on two different courts. The authors are joining us this morning to dish all about it. Maya and Jonathan, thank you so much for being here on GDC. Good morning. Good morning. So um, I'm sure you guys don't get to uh, wake up and talk on um, Zoom without having the baby in the background very often. But <laughs> uh, Maya, you were only eight years old when Jonathan was arrested and convicted. Uh, tell us how you became aware of his situation and how you all ended up meeting. Sure. So I was um, 18 years old when I actually met Jonathan in person. My extended family that I grew up with in Missouri <clears throat> excuse me, had met Jonathan uh, through a prison ministry opportunity. And Jonathan quickly became a part of our family. Um, my godparents um, started visiting Jonathan every weekend, just very um, interested and invested in him as a person and his case and his wrongful conviction. And so through that relationship, I met Jonathan right before I went off to Yukon um, when I was visiting them. And we hit it off, um, became friends and over the years just developed a friendship yeah and jonathan your conviction was overturned in march of 2020 you all now have that beautiful baby boy i was just speaking of so what lessons from everything you went through do you intend to teach him um one i just want to encourage him you know and prepare him because you know this in this world we live in a broken world and Bad things can and often, you know, may, may happen. You just, you just never know. I just want to prepare him for that and just, just encourage him and just, just to hold on and not to give up. Um, I want to encourage him to speak up for the voiceless. I want to encourage him to, uh, to be a man of his word. Uh, I want to, I want to teach him to take care of family and take care of his community and, and to love animals and to, uh, and to honor God. Yeah, you mentioned uh, being a voice for the voiceless. One of the strongest themes of the book is the question you ask all of us to ask ourselves, am I living out my purpose? Uh, looking to the future, do you all plan to continue to be involved in prison reform and social justice issues? Yes, in one way, shape, form, or, or another. We, uh, 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 we have uh, outlets now. We have a, a nonprofit that Maya started uh, called Win With Justice. Um, there, there are guys that uh, that are still in prison that still need help and advocacy, and uh, I have I've partnered with the Exoneration Project, uh, and continue uh, continue to want to speak out, you know, for those people to for criminal justice reform, conviction, uh, conv conviction integrity units, things like that. Conviction integrity units. That's uh, amazing work uh, that you all still have yet to do. I'm glad that you're still looking both ways ahead and also behind at the people who are uh, still needing help. You've had rave reviews on the book already. The great Michael Jordan, of all people, said this about your book. Maya and Jonathan's story is truly inspiring. Love and Justice is about faith, sacrifice, and perseverance in the face of seemingly insurmountable odds. It's also a powerful reminder to challenge injustice when we see it. A Love and Justice, a story of triumph on two different courts is available right now. Maya and Jonathan, again, thank you so much for spending a little time with us here on GDC. Appreciate it.